Since its foundation in 1794, Ecole Polytechnique conducts high-level research and provides excellent multidisciplinary education. Furthermore, the institution has always been committed to exchanging and sharing knowledge and continues to foster an open and international outlook. The school includes 45% international students, 43% international faculty staff and welcomes many exchange students, visiting professors and researchers every year. We encourage our students and faculty staff to gain international experience during study exchange semesters, internships or visiting research periods. Ecole Polytechnique also has many ties with excellent higher education institutions in Asia, enabling our community to discover this diverse and rich environment. My name is Nina. I'm a third year bachelor student in the mathematics and economics major. I'm French and Brazilian. I went to Tokyo for my fifth semester on exchange. The classes were very different from the ones at Polytechnique. I got to take classes outside my major, which I really enjoyed. And I got to meet a lot of people from different nationalities. It was the first time I went to Asia. And I was a bit scared, but very excited and I learned a lot about Japanese habits and culture. I took courses in economics mostly, one math course, and then I took two courses that were a bit outside my major, which were food safety and agricultural sciences. That actually turned out to be amazing for me because I want to do agricultural economics. So taking those courses allowed me to take classes which showed me whether I actually liked it or not. Being in Japan allowed me to discover new passions or like develop new things. I really got to understand what it is that makes me me and what it is that makes me happy. I definitely think it's important to study abroad. The world is more and more connected. We need to know how to communicate with people of different cultures, of different languages, whether that is by speaking the same languages and having to explain concepts or even not speaking at all the same language and having to help each other out. I'm Samuel Hon. I come from Singapore. I'm on a double degree program with NUS, the National University of Singapore, and Eco Polytechnic. So, as part of the double degree program, I am currently studying in Eco Polytechnic for the second and third year. But before that, I was studying in NUS for the first for about two years. Another two years, and for my masters, I'll be going back to Singapore to do the final year. So, as for my preparation period before coming to France or after coming to France. I arrived in January and there were about three months of courses just for us internationals to get used to the French way of teaching, the way things are taught in French and you know just getting used to the new notations and everything. These three months were really interesting because it's just revision courses and you kind of see everything that you've seen before but at the same time you haven't really seen any of it before because it's all in a new language and it's taught in a new way. The differences between studying in Singapore and studying in France. Studying in Singapore is a lot more indirect, if I could say, at least mathematics, which is what I'm studying, whereas the French method approach is more direct. One is not necessarily better than the other, but they are different, and it really gives you more opportunities to really explore or try to understand math deeper. It has given me a complementary vision, different perspective, which is very important in general for sciences. It gives you more variety in the way you think, and I guess more insight towards things that are new to you.